Hey guys, um, in this video uh, we are going to solve this little bit annoying problem in this local WordPress development setup. Uh, so I have a local by Flywheel. I was trying to create a new site on that and I'm getting this annoying warning saying missing host entry. This site may be inaccessible. Okay, so if I try to fix it, it won't really work for now. So it says, oh, oh couldn't update host file. Okay. And then the problem with this is if I try to open the site, I'll just try to start the site first. And if I try to open the site, it's not really working for me. So as you can see, uh, the site isn't loading and it's saying it can't reach the page, which is really weird. And I was struggling with this error for quite a bit of time. And I tried uh, figuring out different ways, but I couldn't find a permanent solution for this one. But Today we are gonna implement a temporary solution that will make the site work for now. Uh, so let's, let's get started. For this purpose, uh, let's go to the file manager, uh, sorry, the file explorer. And then I'll just go into my PC. And then let's go to the, my C drive and where my Windows is. I'll click on Windows and inside of the Windows, I'll just go to System32. System32 and then I'll go to etc. Sorry, drivers. Drivers and then inside of that, I will go to etc. And then I can see all those different files. So first thing first. In the view over here, if you click here, make sure that if you hover over show, make sure that you saw like hidden items. And then also make sure that you have file name extension. Uh, sorry, you, you are also seeing the file name extensions as well. Just click on that. Now I get to see my file name extension as well. So now I can see there is one host file and there another host that I see but I don't really care about this one for now. I just need to worry about this file. So for that purpose, what I will do is I'll just open a new file explorer right here. And I'll just put it right here in the side. Um, so now let's open the desktop over here. And then I'll just, what I do, what I will do is just copy it here. And then I'll just paste it in the desktop. So now I will just make edits to this file over here. I'll just right click. And then you can just edit this file in Notepad. So the file will look like this. If I go down here, down here, I already have local sites. So now what I have to do is just before the local end, if I go here, I can see like this thing. So what I do, what I will do is I'll just go and I'll just copy four different things. Just copy four, like the four lines and then come down here. I'll just paste them right here. And then now I have four different things. What I will do again is go back to the local and then I see my site domain is demo site dot local. So I didn't copy that correctly, but I'll just, um, I'll just change it right here. So I copied and pasted the last four one. So what I will do is I'll just paste it right here with a local. And then I'll just replace wherever my previous one was with the new URL. All right, so I got this one. I will just save this one and I'll just close this one. Now I have my, I think my site was open here. Now let's refresh this site. Host file which is updated over here. I'll just move it here. And then I will have to replace the file in the destination. And then I will have to give it the permission. And then it will be done. Now if I go in here, um, it's still saying this one, but I, will, I don't have to do anything for now. I can just click on open site. Yeah, it's working now. So guys, this was just a temporary solution for now. It should be working for you now. I don't really know what's exactly causing the problem. I tried uninstalling and I tried doing everything, but I am still not able to figure out the actual problem behind the problem. So if I figure something permanent solution for this one, I will just let you guys know. I'll just make another video on that topic. But for now, you guys can solve this problem like this as well. All right, that was all for today. I hope you guys love this video. If you guys love this video, don't forget to hmm, like, comment, and subscribe to the channel for future updates. Thank you so much.